Hey guys, what's up? This is Devony, and I wanted to come on here and do a quick little handbag collection video and just show you some of my handbags. I have a very small collection. I mean, I really don't see a lot of reasoning behind having a bunch, bunch of handbags because like I can only use one at a time. But, you know, if I see a handbag that I like, I'm going to buy it. Um, there's no particular count that I have to have or anything like that. Um, my next bag is, might be a 25 gold Birkin. When I say gold, I mean this color in Hermes. Like, this is a Hermes planner that I've had for forever at this point. But, like, this is the color that they call gold. Um, yeah, so... Uh, I may be getting that, uh, but I'll see because, I mean, that's not even... I do like bags that color. I used to have a bag that color, but I don't right now in my collection. So let's jump into this collection. Okay, and I'm just going to pick up bags in the order in which they are around me because this is, is going to be real quick. I have this small handbag right here. This is a crossbody. It is made to be worn like this i wear it on my waist because my waist is small enough for me to wear it because it adjusts with the little chanel ball on it so i'll wear it on my waist but it is like a bona fide cross body bag um it's from chanel and it is lambskin and it's just an easy little bag that i could just throw on if i'm going to out to eat the brunch or something if I don't want to carry a lot it's really not gonna hold a lot I mean I don't know you probably could get a decent amount of stuff in here like one lip gloss and maybe I don't know I don't know what else but yeah so that's that on that that is the I think this is a clutch on chain yeah clutch with a chain so yeah, that's that on that. The next bag in my area, my fav one of my most favorite bags of all times is this Fendi bag that I can wear across body. I love like this bag right here matches with everything. Like <laughs> I love this bag. Like I love this little bag. And um I got this one in the Fendi store at Ventura Mall. And ever since I bought this bag, like, I can, I don't baby my bags at all. And this is just, like, an excellent, excellent bag. This is a um, mini double F test something, something. That's the information on this bag. But, yeah, I love this bag. I don't remember how much it cost, but I know it wasn't expensive and... It has like a suede interior and this is like one of my most favorite workhorse bags. Next bag, this is a Louis Vuitton something. I don't know, but this is a travel bag and um, let me see, let me see what the official name of it is. I took it out. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what this bag is called because I don't see the paperwork in here right now. But um, this is a bag that I use just for travel. Right now, I have air paper in it to keep it standing up. Um, I I use this, and I want to say this might be like the MM size of it or a GM size. I don't know, but this is just like a travel bag. But I can't remember the name of it right now. And it comes with this tag on it. It comes with this tag. I got my initials put in gold on it. D and H. Um, yeah. So, and these are my maiden initials. My maiden name ends with an H. Which is the name of this channel anyway. So, it doesn't matter because my married name is a G. But, yeah. So, this is a travel bag that I don't remember the name of. But I absolutely love this bag. All right, next next two bags I'm just gonna talk about together. 
I bought these bags because they are so convenient, so easy to wear. Um, I was going to get the Louis Vuitton one, which I may still get the Louis Vuitton one, uh, bum bag. But it was just so big. It, it was just so big. But this was like perfect. If I had on a dress or something and I just wear this kind of across me. And it's like perfect size for my body and my frame. Um, the Louis Vuitton one is a little bit bigger. But then I'm thinking maybe I might appreciate the bigger size. Um, this one is a good size. I mean, this one, the color was perfect. This is like a cream color. These are both made by coach i hadn't bought anything from coach in a very long time but um yeah now i have a but like i have some coat oh i should have put that in my new end video i had two skirts here from coach that came in but yeah so that's two bum bags i have the louis vuitton alma uh bb i want to say is the name of this uh it comes with a crossbody strap when i wear it i put the strap on it but i wear it uh like this um i wear it with the handle i love this bag too it matches with everything um and when i bought this bag i just felt like it was perfect time and i walked in i asked them did they have it they said yes it just got out we just pulled it out it was um, made in France. It says it right here on, on these bags. It'll say made in France. Um, and I also bought like a little pochette that I have downstairs with the little gold um, chain on it that I bought with it. And that one came from France too. They came together. So they were able to stay together because I bought them both at the same time um, from the Louis Vuitton and Bloomingdale's at Aventura Mall. So yeah, I love this bag. Um, it has the feet. Uh, it's just like it's just a cute little relaxed but classy bag. I just love this bag. This is a very very cute girly feminine bag, and I love it. And last but not least, because um, I have one vintage Burberry bag up there, but that's so old. Like I've had that bag for at least. 20 years i don't know a very long time so i'm not even gonna pull that down but my most recent handbag is this my most is my chanel trendy cc in black um i want to say this is the small i'm pretty positive this is the small because i think this one was the one that's like 5900 or something like that um and yeah, I, I absolutely love this bag. I will say that this bag is heavy, but I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. Um, this is one of my most favorite, favorite. Uh, oh, 5,600. It was 56. Um, I think this bag is beautiful. It makes, it goes with everything. You could dress it up. You could dress it down. Um, yeah, and I, I, I love this bag. So... This will be in my collection forever. Actually, all the bags that I have here, I mean, unless they give out, like that Fendi bag is gonna give out. Um, I don't know, the Coach ones, I don't know. that The cream color one, I don't think it's gonna ever give out, so I don't know. But uh, this bag should not ever give out. Uh, this bag is beautiful. This will be here forever. Um, the next bag that I'm probably gonna get is either gonna be the Birkin 25 or 30 in the gold if I could get one. I feel like every time people have all these stories about it being so hard but I feel like every time I have ever gone into a Hermes I felt like they low-key tried to offer me a Birkin the first time when I got when I got that planner years ago it was two women buying black Birkins and the lady kept saying are you sure you don't want anything else are you sure you don't want any and me and my husband was in the store looking at her like what else would we and that's before i knew anything about how the whole birkin process went or whatever that was like 10 years ago or whatever so i don't know but then i don't know after all the controversy about the bag i'm not even sure if i mean it's a bag that i've always liked but i'm not even sure if i want to be carrying i don't know i don't know but i also think i'm gonna get a chanel uh gabrielle bag um so that might be the next bag that i buy and it'll probably be in black chevron black on black because i almost bought it already almost bought it last week 
um, before the price increased. But I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. And you all will know because I will do an unboxing on it if I do buy it. Anyway, I'm trying to keep these videos under 10 minutes. So that is it for my handbag collection. I will see you all later. Peace.